Hello everyone, this is Fenris Lycon, here for another game of Surviving Mars Beyond and Below. I am determined to actually make it to an asteroid in today. Probably not this episode, we are, I believe, just waiting on actually finding an asteroid. We do have our little asteroid lander. Ooh, Refugees Crisis, so we have a new event. Uh, recent political turmoil on Earth has driven many refugees to seek shelter far from the mother planet as possible. Accepting some refugees in the colony would generate both funds and good press for us. The social translation is never entirely smooth, though. Uh, so we can either get 10 or 30. We do have a whole dome. The 10 morale hit. I think I'll just do 10. Food tends to be the thing you have to worry about when having just a huge population increase. In fact, we can almost fit them totally into that dome. And I think it's water we need to be concerned about. Do we have a vapor moisturizer? We do, so we could actually get one down. Piping. Sector scan. But we're just waiting for our recon center to actually find us an asteroid, and we should be able to go on to it. I don't actually know everything we need to do it, so it will be a very a new experience for me, and I am very excited. I'm definitely determined to make that happen today. What else do we have? I did reorder the research a little bit just to get us electronics. We do have a lot more that needs maintenance. Hey, 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 stay away meteors. Our fuel is looking very good. And we do have our rocket coming from Earth to Mars with a bunch of circuitry oh and we have resources are uh, low. a whole bunch of resources down here we can grab so let's uh load those up mostly want these electronics oh man there's a whole bunch grab the polymers too and we still have more we'll use the elevator Shabam. Sector scanned. Get you unloaded. We are currently deep scanning. Why are we not getting built? Are we actually out of uh, concrete? Ooh, we are. Uh, with the drone hub, we can make use of this concrete deposit, so we should do that right away. Ooh, okay. Asteroid. An S type. Asteroids are the second most common type, mostly. Composed of exotic minerals, which we want, and metals, which we don't care. They never have water. Okay, so let's plan a visit. Very excited. So, potentially some polymers too. We only have five souls. It takes eight. I believe this rocket... Let, let me just go back quickly. Um, so it takes 45. I'm assuming it takes 45 to get back, and I think I want to take the fuel there, so... Because it doesn't have rocket, uh, it doesn't have water. So, send you. Okay, uh, it's preparing with 35. So, it must be easier to come back. One, what's the pre, oh, okay, we, right, we have one of these extractors as a prefab. We got that for free for the research or buying the rocket. I don't quite know. Interesting. Can we add these without? Okay. Okay, so this is the like auto. Um, do we want to try and bring anything else? We do have a little bit extra. I'm just going to bring the extra fuel just in case. Uh, I know it takes 45 to get there. It only loaded 35, but we'll just leave the extra fuel there. It won't be a big deal. I'd rather not get stuck. 
Uh, I'm assuming the concrete's for batteries. Yeah, let's do that. Although, uh, we need to actually go get the concrete. Shucks, shucks, shucks. Okay, let's get the concrete extractor up and running right away. I'll just connect it to our power grid. Put this as high priority. Uh, I think we will also put a rocket as high priority. We don't particularly have a ton of drones. Oh, one more cable. Okay, let's do this. It's nice too that happened at the beginning of this episode. So this one will actually just be, yep, renegades can steal stuff. We'll get them constantly with just rebel yell. Normally you just get them with uh, low morale. All right, we also need you, once you're done unloading, to go and pick up some concrete for us. Sector scanned. Go pick up some concrete for us. Syria does need some machine parts for maintenance, but I'm not I'm not too worried. Uh, this one doesn't need too much concrete either, only five, so we should be able to produce it very quick. Anything else? Oh, it launches automatically? Yes, okay. Um, it takes, if we go to our planetary, it takes eight hours. We have our rocket here. Uh, you need a place to put electronics, it looks like, or we just need to unload you. I'm just going to wait until this gets built. I'm going to leave this for our um, asteroid rocket, Airwolf. And once we Sector scanned. I will pause it once we get to the asteroid. Okay. So, prepare for landing. Take a moment to load. Okay, so this is the little asteroid. I probably should have saved. So, there are metal... Deposits. This is the exotic, and there's some surface ones. So how far? Well, can you not actually? Um, wow, if they cannot. If that's. I can't tell if that's the dust or the. That must be the dust range, which shouldn't be too bad. But I, in case it is the. Um, wow, it's actually really tough to uh, land on here. And I'm just worried. That has to be the dust range, right? It's tough to see the. Um, I hope this actually works as a drone commander, but if not, I want to have it very, very, very close to that. There we go, right here. Anomaly found. Let's. Uh, we don't have the ability to use. There we go. Um. RC vehicles. Cool. Landed. We've made it. It's important to keep an eye on the time we've left on the asteroid. When the window passes, we won't have the means to return to Mars anymore. Anything left on the asteroid when our time runs out will be lost forever. So make sure the landers are loaded and refueled before our time runs out. Let's focus on getting those exotics. Okay. So it does take. Ah, it does take 45. It was trying to trap me here. Shame on you. Shame on you. Let's hope it actually gave us everything we needed to get this up and running. So we'll do the extractor. 
Um, okay, we do have the full range, which is excellent. I'm assuming we don't get hit by... Uh, how much power do we need for that? Ooh, I should have looked. Um, I am assuming... I wish... I'm assuming it's also 5, 4... Uh, I should do it. One, two, three, four, five. No, it's six, so it's a little bit more. And uh, I'm assuming solar panels still work here. So we'll build a few. There are kind of metals, the surface metals. We'll also bring, I think, the deposit. So we can kind of unload, I guess, reload. Beautiful. Okay, so it only takes 7.5, and we should actually get the battery down, too. We, do, we did bring the concrete specifically for that. Okay, so it's... I hope it's considered night. On Mars, this is the night time. Um, and exotics are not in the Universal Depot. Uh, there we go. They have their own. So we'll get one down. So they'll start collecting the surface metals. Oh, and there's one over here. Oh, and we're just in range. But we can't actually build another extractor, right? Um, that's fine. This one gets graded faster, or mined faster. So we should have a um, pretty good haul, and we just need to watch the um, time. We'll speed things up. <laughs> we don't need to be on slower, especially when we can't have uh, any of the max. I will say the asteroid does look um, pretty, pretty cool looking, especially for, I guess, like exotic minerals. I do know that exotic matter is uh, actually a thing in scientific data. We don't know if it, um, like it's a concept. It's matter that has negative mass. So what does that mean? It means that, uh, so normal matter attracts, um, all matter is attracted to itself, so it pulls matter to it. If you think like space time, that's like the, the, the dip. Everything kind of goes down that, that gravity well. With negative mass, you have a, um, all of that's reversed. It pushes things away from itself. So it's in theory, if it does exist, it shouldn't concentrate because it will push itself away. And you can get these weird things where if you have matter and you have uh, exotic matter. The exotic matter will push the matter away and the matter will pull the exotic matter. So you can kind of get these um, weird interactions. And in theory, you can um, do some really crazy, in theory, like physics breaking things. New planetaries. Can we actually make, ooh, an unknown. Those are fun. It only takes drones. We are, have been so lucky with these planetaries. I think we have a rocket ready. Yeah, we'll send that. Ooh, ooh, oh, I hope I didn't break it. Okay. Ooh. It's being a little weird. I'm going to go back to, scanned. like, load to Mars. Okay, we have um, people we need to land, so we'll get you down first. I probably actually should have just sent this one to, um... Actually, I'll do that. I'll cancel this one. And we'll get you sent to Earth, and we'll use... New colonists have arrived. ...this one to, um do the planetaries. We'll also get rid of this landing pad as we have the moment to do that. Bye. We'll land you. Uh, we did open you up and we should actually upgrade our moisture vaporizer. So we should be good on housing and we should be good on move you closer to all of our buildings. Um, ooh, I lost the thought. We, uh, workplaces. 
So they just need a moment to move over. In fact, whoops, 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 I probably have this turned on, which I do, which is why they're not moving. Please apply, please go find new housing. Good, good, good. That's exactly what we want to see. In fact, it's really nice if people move into your because Sector these, scanned. Uh, housing are more comfortable. We have 70 over 60. Uh, we've discovered a new asteroid. Wait, a new... Uh, that one did not show. Kuiper Brout object. So is that a pre-warning? What does that mean? Um, our elevator is broken. That's fine. We have our little time, I guess. So it's three souls. We don't really have a lot of time. Requested payload. What? Oh, wait. So I want to... How do I get things back? Because in theory, we could load this up with stuff and send it back to Mars and then wait for resources to unload. Yes. Okay, there we go. Uh, we want to make sure, so let's leave these, uh, I guess we take our drones each time. Uh, we'll just wait. We don't need to bring everything. We don't really need the metals, but we could bring them. Looks like we gathered up most of them on here. I wonder how you're expected to go down here. Maybe build ramps? Can we build ramps here? We can. Uh, so if we do something like this. We could grab, what, 11. <laughs> this would take uh, produce 370 but let's see if the ramp is still kind of being bugged out yeah in theory there should be quite a lot more someone edit this leave the um leave that We'll pull that. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm gonna wait. Um, I'm worried. I don't think it's worth it to go for back for just um metals. That's what we would be basically converting our fuel into. Uh, I do not. I don't want to wait until the last minute either. And when we get back to Earth with one of our rockets. I guess we want to get some more of those prefabs too. We discovered a new pulse. Oh, so we make minor discoveries. What do minor discoveries do though? It doesn't do anything if we click on them. Do we get science for it? I wish it was more clear when it um, did that. Let's go to a planetary. Let's do this one. The unknown ones are always the more fun, more dangerous. We could lose a rocket. Uh, I guess we do have the spare rocket. So that is definitely something that could happen. Uh, we do have a few um, refugees can um, actually, so we have two souls. We'll do it on the last soul, we'll move back. Uh, we do not have enough power, looks like. Ooh, let's throw down a few more solar panels. Which is probably why I, um, wasn't having this open to begin with, so we'll be a little bit Resources cold during the night. Uh, we are going to turn you off at night because they're batteries, but it'll be one one soul. Uh, if we look, 
very quick, let's check it. Look at a colonist. I want to look. Yeah, we have a whole bunch of renegades. Not good, but not something we can really do. We get one basically every soul. I want to look at officers. Okay, we have no officers. If we Research had complete. Officers, we could try and steal some things from our um, more workers from our rivals. We that's not an option, so we won't worry about it. All right, we should be good now on power. Uh, we do want one more battery. We are producing polymers, so batteries are not a terrible thing to build. I'll squeeze you in right there. Sector scanned. Oh, we need a uh, depot for the electronics. So they can actually unload these. All right. How long do we have? We have one more soul? We do. We definitely overbuilt this a little bit. That's fine. What do we get when we scrap this? Polymers and machine parts. So, in theory, if we hit like a breakpoint where we don't think we're going to get another five exotic minerals, we can um, break this down to get machine parts, but I want to keep it. I, um, it works better when you have the five. Well, this is going to be end up being a longer one, but I think I'll leave us off here and we'll um, actually return to Earth with exotic minerals in the last one. This episode was a little bit longer, but there's more content from the new DLC, so I think it's worth it. Right, I'll see you guys in the next episode. I'm super excited that we've gotten to the asteroids. See you later.